What's good, everybody? It's your boy JB Trap House Boxing, and I'm back again with another video. Um, I didn't get a chance to do this last night. You know, I didn't uh, particularly see what happened. You know, I heard about it, but I wasn't aware of uh, Javante Tank Davis losing his belt on the scale. Um, shout out to uh, Boxing 24/7, by the way, man. You know. I've been I've been following uh keeping up with what you've been doing, uh Boxing twenty four seven. You're doing a great job, brother. But um Yeah, this is the second time in a row Tank loses his bet on the scale. So, you know, uh Tank been getting a lot of slack, man. You know, a, a lot of slack. You know it's been <clears throat> it's been people out here that's been wanting him to face Vasily Lomachenko why he had that belt you know um, but if, unfortunately Tank said he wasn't ready yet or whatever the case may be the TMT stable said he wasn't ready yet so uh, you know that's that but um, Tank also alluded to that he was going to be moving up to 135 soon so, I don't know. I just don't like the, the lack of discipline that, that Tank been displaying, you know, here lately. You know, Florida and everybody talking about he the new, you know, star or whatever. I'm not doubting that, but that's not a good look when you not when you can't make weight. That shows the, the lack of unprofessionalism, lack of maturity. And it shows somebody who doesn't, who doesn't, uh, like to assume full responsibility all in the same token so me personally I still think that him and Lomachenko is going to be on the collision course no matter what they still because the the fans been demanding to see it Every, people want to see that fight still you know um, they can they can they can come to an agreement I don't I don't think that Tank on just move up, you know, keep moving up fast, 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 because he's a small guy. I mean, what Tank is, about five, 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 six or some shit? You know, it, the the most I could see him going up is 140, and that would be rough for him. Cause, I mean, I ain't going to say it would be rough, but he's so, he's so short. So, you know, I don't never see him being a welterweight or no shit like that. But um, I don't know. Possibly, I don't know. But Tank seemed like he uh, uh it seemed like he likes to eat. You know, um, seems like he packs on weight very well. If he don't keep it under control, you know, especially you know how his frame is, you could tell he could hold some weight. You could tell he get wide. Um, but you know now he got to go through. Now he got to go fight for a strap again. At one thirty, he gonna go to one thirty five, and then he gonna have to fight for a strap and do all this shit when he was already a fucking title holder. You know that's just I don't know, man. I don't know. But either either he he's on his way to you know uh, fight Robert Easter. Which could be a possible, you know. I mean, it could be a possibility, you know, or uh, you know, some other champions. I don't see him just going to one thirty-five, just you know, just tapping into Robert Easter immediately. You know, I, I see him aiming at the Flanagans and you know, guys such like that. But the thing is, if if uh, Mikey Garcia decides to stay at one thirty-five. <clears throat> You know, I wonder if if that that fight will ever happen. I don't I don't know how long Mikey has stayed went there. I don't even know what weight weight uh class Mikey fighting at right now. So that's a whole other thing. But uh, I don't know, man. I just hope Tank get his shit together and and, and get this under wraps, man, and and start being be being uh, more professional. Start conducting himself like a little young champion, man. You know, this shit don't make no sense. 
You know, I don't know if he, it was a strategic move or what, but come on, man, tighten up. I'm out, man.